breaking news. Welcome to today's headlines. ICPC raids Brata's Abuja home recovers over 1 billion naira cash. Other multi billion naira luxury items. ICPC raids Brata's Abuja home recovers over 1 billion naira cash. Other multi billion naira luxury items. To my dear listeners from wherever you're listening from, please stay tuned as I read today's news. Operatives of the Independent Corrupt Practices and Other Related Offenses Commission, ICPC, have raided the home of a former chief of army staff to Cobra Thai. The ICPC operatives reportedly recovered over a billionaire from Buratai, who is now Nigerian's ambassador to the Benin Republic. The Antigraft Agency also recovered over 50 luxury watches, including at least two Rolex Verities from the former army boss. According to sources, the Nigerian Financial Intelligence Unit, NFIU, had alerted the ICPC when it commenced a probe of an alleged military contractor named Salisu. An ICPC source said, NFIU discovered that 500 million naira was paid into Salisu's account at once and quickly flagged it. When Salisu was queried, he said he was a military contractor. He was unable to show any evidence of carrying out any contract for the military. The NFIU later transferred the case to the ICPC, who proceeded to carry out more investigation and the raid, which occurred last week. Sahara reporters at first reported the raid on Thursday night, which put the recovered funds at about 1.85 billion naira. Sources said, ICPC officials stormed the house in the Wuse area beside the National Open University of Nigerian campus in Abuja last week after it received a tip off from a whistleblower. It was gathered that the huge cash was part of the billions of naira here marked for the purchase of arms and ammunition by the Muhammad Buhari led government. Last week Thursday, ICPC officials stormed a house in Wuse, area of Abuja, beside National Open University, and arrested a man, Kabiru Salisu after they saw 815 million naira cash in the house, a source told Sahara reporters. He claimed the money belonged to Toko Bratai, who was in Kotonu at the time. Officials of the ICPC took him to an office where another 1 billion naira in cash was also discovered. Also, bulletproof cars, BMW, G-Wagon World, 450 million naira were recovered. 
Serious pressure has been mounted to claim money found was only 30 million naira, another source said. One of the sources said, We discovered that the place is owned by Buratai and he has been working with the man to loot military funds for many years. It is quite unfortunate that Nigerian soldiers are suffering at the war front, war front due to lack of equipment. Speaking to the publication, Bratai said no warrant was obtained to search his house. In March 2021, Nigerian National Security Advisor NSA Babagana Munguno reviewed that funds running into billions of naira meant for the procurement of arms and ammunition under the past service chiefs were unaccounted for. His revelation came a few months after President replaced Buratai and other service chiefs. Others were former Chief of Defense Staff, Gabriel Onan Nishak and Chief of Year Staff, Abu Bakr Sadiq and Chief of Naval Staff, Ibok Ibaz. According to Moguno, neither the money nor the arms were on the ground upon the resumption of the new service chiefs. Now that he, President Buhari, has brought new people service chiefs, hopefully they will devise some ways. I am not saying the former chiefs, the former service chiefs, diverted the money, but the money is missing. We don't know how, and nobody knows for now. He had said. To my dear listeners, from wherever you're listening from, please stay tuned and do drop by at the comment section and let's know what your view is all about. Thank you for listening.